What's up, everybody? I'm here with a uh, a video. It's pretty late in the, I guess technically it's the morning, but like I just got home from uh, a show. I just saw Nails, Toxic Holocaust, Gates Creeper, um, the band with or uh, what is it called? Like rats, not amongst rats, because that's a brutal death band, and um. I forgot what the other one was, but, but, yeah. but uh, anyway, <laughs> if you know what the tour I'm talking about, you know what the other brand is, if you care to know, because I kind of don't, but whatever. So, I only got four things here, so it's probably going to be a quick video. Um, I'm going to start off with uh, the merch. First thing I got is uh, the opening band is a sludge hardcore band from uh, Chicago, obviously. Um, featuring, I think, one, maybe two ex-members of Weekend Nachos. Obviously, they broke up, and they continued with this band called Like Rats. Long sleeve shirt, um, just a ram skull, uh, in a, kind of like the dirty ground, and, uh, it says Like Rats right there, then, uh, down both sides. You got the long sleeve look with their logo on it, which is a cool, cool logo. Like Rats is a good band, great band. Um, because of where I'm from, people love their weekend nachos. Oh, and on the back, it's also got their logo. Awesome band. Um, yeah, because where I'm from, people like weekend nachos. So. Uh, there's a lot of Lincoln Nachos fans there, so that band was very fitting. Other, uh, shirt I bought was a Toxic Holocaust shirt. They were basically sold out completely on all of the merch. On, uh, Gates Creeper only had 3XL shirts, and 2XL, and I am a large, so... I didn't get a Gates Creeper shirt, or else I would've, because they were amazing. So, I got a Toxic Holocaust shirt. Love this band, have for a long time. Design's pretty cool. Could be a little bit cooler, but you know, I can dig it. Um, yeah, the Joel Grind is getting a little tubby, which is alright. Getting a little older. But uh, yeah, they, they did great. Um, super glad I finally got to see them. That's actually who I went for. And uh, Nails wound up blowing me away as usual. And Gates Creeper was, oh my god. Mm. So, alright, I, I got LPs. LPs, that's not something you see on this channel. LPs. First one is um, the first album by the band Among, or Like Rats. This album is, or Like Rats, yeah, Like Rats. This is self-titled. Like Rats. Now, bear with me, this does look like um, Brothers and Sisters by the Allman Brothers Band, but it's not. I was holding these next to the pit, so there's a little crease right there which pisses me off. But, like rats, I actually haven't gotten to listen to this, obviously, because I just got home. Here's the LP um, sleeve. Yeah, you can see a little bit better there. It's a crease. God, it's not bad. Um, pull out the work record, and it comes with a nice lyric sheet. I don't know whose children these are. I'm assuming it's got uh, somebody from the band. Maybe Andy Nelson. Yeah, this is uh, their debut album. I was on the toilet at the venue, and uh, I was reading a review on this album, deciding whether or not to get it white sleeve and one of the coolest record colors that I own it is on Oxblood love this color record very cool label on side B this is side A um, yeah I like this color record quite a bit I'm not too uh, versed in my vinyl you could see that I'm watching American Dad um, but it's cool. So yeah, I was reading a review, and some guy literally gave it 100% on the Metal Archives, which if you 
Do you have a read reviews on the Metal Archives? That's a, a rare thing right there. So I decided to take the jump and spend the whole twelve dollars. Twelve dollars for an LP, even if it sucks, it's twelve bucks. I'm sure I know somebody that wouldn't thoroughly enjoy it if I didn't. So yeah, that is like rats with the baby. And lastly, the band that blew me away the most. Debut album, Sonorian Deprivation by Gates Creeper. Oh my god. These guys kill live. Americans playing old school death metal. Great old school death metal. Uh, the singer signed it. His name is uh, Hellhammer or whatever. Uh, great. Awesome. Um, pull the record out again. Comes with the download card. Uh, ooh, a, kind of a lyric poster book thing. Is there a poster in here too? I don't know what that, but it's a nice lyric sheet. Cool stuff, very cool stuff. Very glad to own this. Um, yeah, old school death metal done right here. And white sleeve on, they called it olive, but I don't, I don't see how this looks olive at all. Oh man, that looks awesome. Um, yeah, it's a gorgeous, gorgeous record. Cool label. Very staticky. Cool label. Very good. Very good. Very cool. Very happy to have this. Sorry, I'm a little tired. It's like one in the morning, as I said. Um, yeah, so that's all I got, guys. Um, this is a great, great show. I would definitely catch it if it comes near you. And if it doesn't, still try to catch it because it's worth it. It's a good show. I know Nails doesn't tour often because they're adults and all that nonsense, but they'll uh, catch them when you can. So that's it for today, guys. I'm fixing to go to bed here in a second. So, hope you enjoyed the video. Keep it greasy.